Hi guys, welcome back. If you're new to my channel, my name is Carmen. Welcome. Hey guys, in this video, numerology reveals what type of business you should start and what type of business would be the most fulfilling and most likely the most successful for you if you started it. Exactly what type of business is going to bring in the most abundance and wealth for you and make you super wealthy? We're going to talk about that today in this video. I know some of you already have your own businesses, but many of you are wanting to start your own business. Many of you want something remote that you can start from your home. And we're going to talk about what exactly the, that best type of business is for you because numerology does reveal this. And numerology is basically like the blueprint for what your soul came up with before you were born, right? I always say that. So it can give you a lot of really good insight. So I'm going to show you how to do that right now. But before we get into it, no matter what type of business you're going to have, you're going to need to have a website, right? It's extremely important in this day and age to have a website. And a lot of you want to work from home. You want to be able to conduct your business from your website so that you can work from home. Or you can travel the world and take your business anywhere with you that you want. So a website is extremely important. I recommend going to bde.codes. Daniel at bde.codes designed a website for me for one of my businesses a couple of months ago and my business has exploded <laughs> ever since he did. The website he designed for me is amazing. It's extremely modern and there's no way in a million years that I could have designed this website myself. <laughs> And I compare it to another website that I have for my numerology business and there's just no comparison. <laughs> and he can do it for you in a fraction of the time that you would be able to create a website, okay? So if you're a busy person like me and you just don't have the time to create your own website or you want to redo your current website and make it even better, then head over to bde.codes. In this day and age, you need to have a really good website because, you know, there's a lot of competition out there. So the better the website you have, the more business, the more traffic you're going to get. So it's extremely important and it's a very, very good investment. It's an investment you will always get your money back on. Okay, so head over to bde.codes and for a limited time, he's going to give you 10% off of building your website the whole entire service. He's giving you 10% off. Okay, that's amazing. That's gonna save you so much money. So head over there and get this deal before it comes to an end because it's limited and he's not gonna be giving this deal out forever, okay? And you get one month free of service as well. Okay, and you use promo code CARMEN to get this deal and do it before it's too late. So we're now going to use numerology to know exactly what type of business you need to start. Make sure to check out some other videos I've done about this too, like how to name your business for success using numerology and how to use numerology to find out when your business will be successful. I will link those videos below in the description box. Okay, and there's only two numbers that we're going to be calculating. It's very easy. It only takes a few minutes to calculate these numbers. If you already know what your numerology numbers are, you can go ahead and check the timestamps in the description box. And that way you'll be able to skip to the rest of the video. To calculate your life path number, you're going to take the month of your birthday and add the numbers together until you get a single digit. Take the day of your birthday and keep adding the numbers together until you get a single digit. And take the year of your birth date and add the numbers together and keep adding them together until you get a single digit. And then you're going to take those three numbers that you got and add them together and keep adding them together until you get a single digit. And that's going to be your life path number. Now, if you get an 11, 22, or 33, you do not add the two numbers together because they are master numbers and you do not reduce them. And to calculate your soul urge number, you're going to use the Pythagorean number system again. And this time, you're only going to find the corresponding numbers to only the vowels within the first, middle, and last name that was written on your birth certificate at the time of your birth. 
And most of the time I consider Y to be a vowel because it usually sounds like a vowel. So take all of the numbers for the vowels you got for your first name and add them together until you get a single digit. Then take all of the numbers you got for the vowels in your middle name and add them together until you get a single digit. And take all the vowels that you got for your last name and add them together until you get a single digit. Then you're going to take those three final numbers and add them together. Keep adding them together until you get a single digit. Unless you get an 11, 22, or 33, those are master numbers and you don't reduce them. If your life path number or soul urge number is a one, then the business that's going to be the most successful, be the most fulfilling, and bring you the most money is going to be a business that creates or starts something that has never been done or seen before. Okay, we're talking about inventive kind of energy here. Something that is different and unique. Possibly creating something brand new that has never been seen before or possibly involving you where you are the product or the business. Okay, we're talking about influencer energy here as well. You being the product, the business, the influencer. And this also involves coaching. Ones often make really good coaches and personal trainers too. Now this could also be selling or promoting products to large numbers of people for any of the things that I just mentioned. Often with this energy, your business will be very influential and it will be a very ambitious business and it will be often the best in its field if you have these numbers in these key placements, okay, as a life path one or a soul urge one. And your business will often be in the spotlight as well. And that is because number one is the ultimate entrepreneur number. This is the number of the entrepreneur. This is not only a wealth number, but it's also a fame number too. Okay, check out my videos about the wealth numbers and the fame numbers. Okay, if you have one of these numbers as your life path or your soul urge, you were born to be an entrepreneur. You were born to be your own boss, to start your own business. This is your path. Okay, this is what you were meant to do and you're going to be successful at it no matter what because the universe wants you to do that and is going to support you and not only that but you were born to be in the spotlight if you have this number in those key places the only number that's both a wealth and a fame number and it's ruled by the sun so you were born to work for yourself and you were born to be successful so congratulations if your life path or soul urge number is a two then the type of business that's going to be the most successful be the most fulfilling and bring in the most money for you is going to be a kind and caring business that is sensitive to customers, has many partnerships, collaborations, and contracts. Okay. And we're talking about counseling businesses here, counseling relationship businesses, and businesses helping to restore peace, harmony, and balance to other people. And it's going to be imperative for you to be working with people one on one. That partnership one-on-one -on -one element is really going to bring a lot of success and be very fulfilling for your business. Now, this could also be selling or promoting products to large numbers of people for any of the things that I just mentioned. If your life path number or soul urge number is a three, then the type of business that's going to be the most successful, most fulfilling, and bring you the most money is going to be a highly creative or expressive business, okay? We're talking about creative, artistic, or communication type businesses, social events, and networking, review, or entertainment type businesses. Any sort of business in which you are creating any of those things, in the creative fields or any type of business in which you are critiquing and reviewing those projects that other people created as well. Any sort of business like that is going to be good for you. Now this could also be selling or promoting products to large numbers of people for any of the things that I just mentioned. If your life path or soul urge number is a four, then the type of business that's going to bring you the most success, be the most fulfilling, and bring you the most money is going to be a hardworking, disciplined, stable, and secure business that often builds, constructs, or assembles things. Okay, so we're talking about construction here. That's a big one, right? Four is the number of structure right? If you look at a building, if you look at a table, I'm always saying that they all have four sides. So it is a number of structure. Anything in which you are creating structures or building structures is going to be good for you with the four energy. Now, also, this includes land and real estate, of course. 
Um, anything that is rustic, that is outdoors, that is outside, involving the elements of the of the planet would be good. We're talking about financial and economic type businesses or law businesses. Anything involving the law would be good. Or ones dealing with natural materials. Okay, so anything involving the elements, like I had said. And because four is a number of structure, any business that brings structure to other people could be good. So like something that helps people to get organized, planned, to get structure into their lives is good. Now this could also be selling or promoting products to large numbers of people for any of the things that I just mentioned. If your life path or soul urge number is a five, then the type of business that's gonna be the most successful, fulfilling, and bring you the most money is going to be a dynamic business that will see a lot of change or will be an agent for change in the world, okay? Something that helps to bring change about in the world or helps to bring transformation and change to other people would be good. Now, this is great for any businesses involving travel, okay? Anything in which you're helping people to travel or there's travel involved. Remote businesses, of course, right? Something that is not stuck in one place is going to be key here. <laughs> and, you know, of course, that because that helps you to travel too, right? And that's important to you with these energies in your chart. Um, but this this is also gonna be a business involving excitement, right? Anything involving excitement, something exciting. Um, and it's gonna be a flexible business or a business dealing with unconventional or out of the box issues and things. So any business in which you help people to travel, help people to have more fun, more excitement, to be more flexible, anything that helps people to get out there, to explore the world, to move around, right? Move their bodies and use their five senses would be good. Anything helping people to be more, become more resourceful, or anything in which you are dealing with something that is out of the box, like I had said, some, something that's unconventional in our world. And lastly, things that are involving your communication skills. Five is ruled by Mercury. So anything in which you are promoting something or having to communicate and express to people why something is good. Okay, so like promotion and sales, that might be good for you as well because you often have good communication skills with these numbers. Now this could also be selling or promoting products to large numbers of people for any of the things that I just mentioned. If your life path or soul urge number is a six, then the type of business that's gonna be the most successful, most fulfilling, and bring you the most money is going to be a highly creative and nurturing or healing or balance restoring type of business, okay? Anything in which you help to bring harmony and balance and restoration or healing or nurturing to something or someone is gonna be good. So these are family children businesses where you're helping families and children in some sort of way. Any business involving love and relationships, businesses involving the community, health and healing types of business businesses beauty businesses anything invol involving beauty and aesthetics is going to be good this could be a creative business anything in which you are creating something creating a project okay or a business dealing with balance and justice and the law right six is a very balanced energy so it has there's a sense of justice with this energy so anything involving where you're bringing fairness and justice to something and possibly even involving the law that could be good too now this could also be selling or promoting products to large numbers of people for any of the things that i just mentioned if your life path number or soul urge number is a number seven then the type of business that is going to be the most successful, most fulfilling, and bring you the most money is going to be either a highly intellectual and technological business or a spiritually based business, okay? So a business involving the intellect and the mind, you know, involving studying and knowledge or technology, like a technology technology based business or some sort of business that is spiritually based okay 
So this is great for scientific, uh, scientific and intellectual type businesses, right? Like I said, like tutoring or studying or anything involving like, you know, large chunks of information, helping people uh, process large chunks of information. This could also be a tech business. Anything involving technology could be good for you as well. Now, most of you will probably fit into the last part of this, which is more of a spiritually based business. If you are watching this video and if you watch my channel, you probably fit into the latter part, which is a spiritually based business or a business that involves spiritual growth and personal development. Okay. Helping people to um, have personal development and self growth, anything involving analyzing people, helping people to analyze themselves on a deeper level. So this could involve psychology too. Self-help is a big one here. Analyzing things is a big one here. And if you do have a spiritually based business, if you can involve something that is spiritually based, but also analytical at the same time, you might really take off and do really well. So like something involving numerology or astrology, right? Which are spiritually based, but they're more analytical because they're involving numbers and patterns. Okay. So those businesses will be the best for you when you have these sevens in these key placements. Now this could also be selling or promoting products to large numbers of people for any of the things that I just mentioned. So if your life path or soul urge number is a number eight, then the type of business that's going to be the most successful, most fulfilling and bring you the most money is going to be a very powerful or lucrative business with influence and status. Okay. And often with this number, okay, because eight is the number of power, it's the number of abundance and money. So um, often with this uh, energy, if you do start a business, you will end up having those things, right? That That's, that's common for eights that you know, that start businesses. They end up with a powerful, lucrative business that has influence and status. So congratulations to you for having <laughs> that eight in these key placements. It's definitely going to help you a lot in the business world for sure. Okay. Now this could be any businesses dealing with finances and money, politics, management, or coaching, and any business focused on profit, power, or leadership could be good for you as well, or a business that helps people to get those things, a business that helps people with leadership, coaching, money, finances, management, politics, which you are helping people with those things. And yes, this could be a business involving life coaching and helping people to manifest things as well. Now, this could also be selling or promoting products to large numbers of people for any of the things that I just mentioned. So if your life path or your soul urge number is a nine, then the type of business that is going to be the most successful, most fulfilling and bring you the most money is going to be a global business that helps the evolution of the planet or that greatly impacts or helps the world and many people. Okay, nine is the number of the world and the universe. So this is gonna be a business that really is worldwide that helps lots of people or it has to be something that is more focused on larger numbers here right so this is going to be great for any businesses that are highly creative spiritual or healing okay and that also involves businesses dealing with politics or world causes okay so I always tell people with the nine energy that if you want to start a business, first of all, start a business that um, makes you a lot of money, but also helps the world at the same time too, right? You see a lot of these businesses, people think that they're nonprofit businesses, but a lot of times they are for profit. They're making a profit, but they're also still helping the world in a big way. Like that business for ocean, where you buy a bracelet and part of the proceeds go to removing plastic from the ocean. Okay, so something like that that makes you money but also helps the world would be good. Or this could be a creative type of business such as involving music or a spiritually based business, right? But the main factor here is it has to be helping with evolution, right? That's the big one here. And, you know, sometimes you will see people with the nine energy go on to create nonprofit organizations. That does happen with the nine energy. Now, this could also be selling or promoting products to large numbers of people for any of the things that I just mentioned. 
So if your life path or your soul urge number is a master number 11, then the type of business that's going to be the most successful, fulfilling, and bring you the most money is going to be a business that greatly inspires, influences many people, or often the first to do something or is that in or is in the spotlight that is a big one here right the main thing here is that 11 is the number of the messenger you're here to bring a message to the world and to other people so how can you turn that into a business some sort of business in which you are bringing that message to other people whatever that message is so something that um, shows people your story you know, often this is a very inspiring energy. So something that inspires people could be good for you. Now, this is also great for any businesses wanting to bring awareness to certain issues. Any business that influences and leads other people or inspires other people, any business that involves coaching and counseling could be good for this 11 energy. Because remember, 11 is a variation of the two energy. And the two energy is great at counseling and mediating. The one energy within you makes you really good at coaching too. So anything involving coaching and counseling would be a great business. And of course, anything that is spiritually based, right? Because like I had said before, 11 is all about bringing a message to people. And of course, we have bringing messages through, through the other side, right? And that involves mediumship often with the 11 energy. You'll often see a lot of them as mediums. So any sort of business in which you are using your psychic mediumship type abilities to bring messages to other people could work for you as well and be very lucrative. Now, this could also be selling or promoting products to large numbers of people for any of the things that I just mentioned. If your life path number or soul urge number is a master 22, then the type of business that's going to bring you the most success, be the most fulfilling, and bring you the most money is going to be a business that builds something that affects or changes the structure of society and something that will last through time, okay? So this is great for businesses wanting achievement and stability. Um, any businesses dealing with building and construction and constructing. So like construction type of businesses or building type of businesses, anything in which you are building a structure. Okay, remember 22 has the four energy as well because if you add the two twos together, you get the four. Four is the number of structure. So anything in which you are helping to bring structure to places or to people or to build those structures. Now, businesses that are dealing with finances, and d businesses that deal with real estate, of course, right? Because real estate is all about building. And also, we also have any businesses dealing with counseling people too, because of the double twos in there, you have some great counseling abilities. Any businesses dealing with family or traditional issues involving the family could be good. And this is also involving any intuitive type of businesses in which you are using your intuition, okay? Intuitively based businesses could be good as well. Now, this could also be selling or promoting products to large numbers of people for any of the things that I just mentioned. And I would also refer to watch number four because that could give you some more insight on this energy also. If your life path number or soul urge number is a master 33, then the type of business that's going to be the most successful, fulfilling, and bring you the most money is going to be a highly creative or expressive healing business, okay? So because of the double threes, right? And three is the number of creative expression. And, you know, when you add it together, you get the six in there. And six is the number of healing. Any sort of business in which you are using your creative talents or your ability to express yourself to heal other people, well, that could be a great business that makes you a lot of money. And, um, you know, like you'll see a lot of um, comedians um, or great actors and stuff. Sometimes they'll have this 33 energy and they have those creative talents, but they're also bringing healing to people through doing that. And now, of course, this, this also involves any business in which you are using unconventional methods of healing, okay? 
because of the double threes in there. So this is great for using artistic and creative or unconventional modalities to heal or to care for customers. You'll see a lot of people with Reiki healing businesses or acupuncture healing businesses or those other kinds of unconventional types of healing as businesses when they have the 33 in these key placements. Now this could also be selling or promoting products to large numbers of people for any of the things that I just mentioned. But I would also refer to number six as well. And you might want to refer to number three as well, because that could give you some more insight also. So let me know in the comments below if this video resonated with you and if you are going to, or you have already started a business in any of the areas that I mentioned. Let me know in the comments below. And if you like this video, hit the like button and share it with other people because it really helps to get this information out there when you do that. And we want to get this information out there to as many people as we can. So thank you so much for all of your support. And I would love to have you subscribe and to become part of the family. You can also follow me on Instagram and Facebook. If you want to get a personal reading with me, you can head on over to my website, starsalignwithcarmen.com. And yes, I do do business numerology readings as well. And thanks for watching. I love you guys and I'll see you in my next video. Take care.